is going to be my first ever monthly favourite. I just, I can't believe how quickly November has gone. It's like, it just came and went. I've got a mix of beauty and fashion and home and a few random little bits. For anybody watching this that doesn't know what monthly favourites are, these are just different products that I've been loving this month. Let's start with, shall we start with beauty? Beauty's always good. Two things that I've been loving this month. The first one is the Garnier Skin Naturals Roll-On Anti-Dark Circles. My camera doesn't focus at all, so I apologise. This was just an impulse buy. I was in the pound shop and I thought, let's have a go. This doesn't have a shade on it, but it was in the pound shop, so it's not quite the right colour for my skin because I am pale. I've been using this every time I've been wearing makeup just under my eyes. It instantly just gets rid of my dark circles. This was only a pound, so it was the only one in the shop, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would go back and get more to stock up for in the summer because I feel like this is going to be used a lot in the summer when I've got a tan. Next for beauty is a blush that I got from Avon. I, again, I apologise for this. This is in the colour Flora. Let me see if I open it up. It's just a really nice corally corally, peachy, really natural. Oh, it's just so pretty. Let me see if I can show you. I don't know if that's focused, so just... This is perfect for my skin tone in the winter because it's not too... I'm not really that confident with my blush. I like it to just look very natural. So when I'm pale and pasty, this just really just adds like a nice glow to my skin. My next two products are body products. I don't know a better way to say that. This is actually leaking all over me because I've just grabbed it out of the shower. Craytons Vanilla and Macadamia. Vanilla and Macadamia Cocoon Shower Burst. This smells incredible. I'm going to open it and have a whiff. Oh. Me and my fiance have been debating about what this smells like. We can't decide between vanilla fudge or Rollo yogurt. It smells really strange, but you know, like the toffee bit that you get at the bottom. bottom that you get at the bottom of a Rollo yogurt. This is what this smells like. Or vanilla fudge, we can't decide between the two. The thing I like most about this is that it lasts on your skin when you get out of the shower. Like, I come out and I'm just like, I smell like fudge. I'm gonna go and buy some more to stock up, I think, because fudge, that's why I like it, because it smells like fudge. Who doesn't want to smell like fudge? Another body pro product is a moisturizing body butter. Again, sorry for the camera. This says it's in. it should smell like mango. But to me, it smells like citrus fruit and oranges and things like this. This is so rich and so thick and so creamy. It's it's a little bit oily, but not in a bad way. Like in the winter, it really just helps your skin so much. I got this from Costco last year. I actually got a set of four of them, and they just they're just so cool. I buy mine off eBay, so you can select which fragrances you want. So I just pick loads of Christmassy ones like nutmeg and gingerbread and log fire and things like that so I've just had them burning all November getting ready for Christmas spirit getting ready for Christmas and they just oh they just smell so good and as I've said before we do have three house cats so it gets a bit smelly they last all day like I've got little eight hour burning tea lights and I can put them in and it will burn all day and will the scent will go completely around the whole house and it lasts if you then if you stop burning it, the smell usually lingers for about two, three days afterwards, so they're really good value. So this just about snuck into my November favourites. I got this probably in the middle of November, so only two weeks ago. But I've just lived in it ever since and it's just this gorgeous black and white cardigan. I can't even find where the sleeves are. There we go. It's so pretty. It's I wanna say it's like a waterfall one, it hangs down at the sides. It's got all these tassels, it's just so warm and snug and I have lived in it pretty much every day for the past two weeks. I think the reason that I love this is that it just goes with absolutely anything. You can just throw it on over the top and it's just so warm and it was such a bargain as well. So this I am loving. I'm a bit ashamed of this next November favourite because they're really in bad condition but I've been living in these this month because they're just so comfortable. They're not, they're really in bad condition and they are these combat style boots. They're just, oh, go up. They're just these combat style boots, and they're just pretty simple. They've got the lace and a buckle there, and a zip on this side. The reason that they're awful, look at that, look at that for a heel. These need rehealing so badly. But every time I go past the shop, I think oh, I can reheal my shoes. I've got them on. I never actually just take them with me into town. 
to reheal them. So they are awful and they're really bad, but these are just so good. Again, I wear I maybe wear skinny jeans and leggings and things like this, so these go with everything I put on. They're just worn every day, hence why they're so bad. Next we've got home products, and again I've got two of these. The first one is these little hotties home fragrance melters. These are so amazing. I'm gonna have to show you. These just come in little tiny little things. So like there's just a normal circle one, then a brown one, and I think I've got a little cute bell. And all of these have different fragrances on them. And you mix them all together with your recipe book that come it comes with, and you mix mix the fragrances together to make different scents. So in the back they've got a page for all holiday recipes. So if you mix a log fire, an alpine and a citrus blizzard, it will smell like a Christmas tree. And these really do. If you get the right little if you get the right little bits, these really do smell exactly like you think they would. My last monthly favourite for November are these. Oh my god. These are you're gonna laugh now when I try and pronounce these. These are Yoda cooking. Yoda cooking. I don't know. These are the most amazing cookies you will ever eat in your life. Like my neighbour gave us these as a gift for helping her out the other week with a painting and oh they're just so good we have eaten the whole tin already. Well I think there's one left. They come with twenty. We ate them all in about three days. She's really bad because they're really unhealthy. But they are so good and she doesn't bring us she doesn't bring them for us very often because her husband gets them from Holland so obviously he's got to bring them back. So when we do get them we just much the more she's promised us some more for Christmas so chances are they will be my December favourites too. That's it for my November favourites I hope that you liked this video everything that I've mentioned will be down there in the description box so make sure that you check it out make sure that you subscribe because this month we're going on a Christmas binge so it's going to be a very Christmassy theme for the whole month of November. Thanks for watching, bye! <laughs>